Welcome. Today we do our poetic tribute to storytellers Walter Benjamin and the Angel of History. Why is Once Upon a Time a Whore? And various other questions we explore today. The four storytellers, Leslie Silco, Gertrude Stein, Walter Benjamin, Grace Ann Rosil, that we've been exploring in the series. Credits today go to Grace Ann Rosil playing Walter Benjamin and myself playing the Angel of History. These are my wings. The first kind of time, how fascism works. Now we're the Oh. Do not put your hope in fascism. I would like to stay. Awaken the dead. Make whole what three fascists have smashed. Stalin, Hitler, Mussolini. But a storm is brewing from paradise. Got caught in my wings with such violence. I propel into the future to which my back has been turned so very long so very long. Walter, put your faith in the Redeemer. Fascist leaders, fascism, is the historical norm. It keeps us in a state of emergency, never ends, and then demands a high price to pay. Ante up, ante up. But with accustomed thinking, people keep hoping that strong, charismatic leaders will save them. Turk Automation The Turk Automaton In this image, the audience sees the puppet on the top, but does not see the hunchback, who is an expert chess player hiding beneath the mirrors. They do not see this apparatus, just as we do not see the fascist ways of controlling society. I am staring, my mouth is open, my wings are spread, I face the past. Historical materialism is like the Turkish puppet that wins all the time. The Turkish puppet hides the hunchback underneath. But who is the hunchback? Put your faith in the Redeemer. Sunflower turning towards the sun. Beware of sunflowers' effect, of charismatic leaders. Put your faith in the Redeemer. The past turns toward the sun, each sunflower tracking the sun. It's heliotropic. Progress narrative of history. Do not put your faith in the progress of technology. This storm is what you call progress. People put their faith in the technology, the bet to save them, but it can be used against them. Put your faith in the Redeemer. 
the path of progress corrupts. It corrupts the working class. Weber put his faith in the Protestant ethic as the spirit of capitalism. It is vulgar Marxism, no better. It is a particular belief that one can directly access the real conditions of history. Do not put your faith in Protestants. The working class cannot be the Redeemer. Put your faith in the Redeemer. Looking back at the wreckage of history. I see the pile of debris of history. It piles up skyward. Angel, you look like you're about to fly away. One big catastrophe keeps piling up wreckage upon wreckage, hurls at my feet. These are timeless times. Do not put your faith in a wasteland of technological development. But the political leaders sustain a stubborn faith in progress. Yes, the pile of debris includes much complicity. My ring is ready for flight. I would like to turn back. If I stayed in these timeless times with you, I would have a little luck. Put your faith in the Redeemer. Looking back at the wreckage of history, now we look forward to the next event. A moment of historical materialism becomes tool of ruling class. Where is the exact point where historical materialism cuts through historicism? Historicism flattens time into a line of events. When will historical materialism leap into the open air of history? An authentic revolution changing history and future. Who can tell such time? You want the enslaved to pray to the avenger and await liberation or revolution in the name of generations of downtrodden or in the name of future generations, put your faith in the Redeemer. Once upon a time is a whore. Beware of once upon a time storytelling it's the whore beckoning you into the whorehouse. Historians Bordello, do not put your faith in that whore. Put your faith in the Redeemer. Sounds a bit harsh. I did children's programming on the radio. Most once upon a time storytelling is a distraction, an addiction, a way to not look at the now. It's a kind of mystical thinking. Spoiled loafers, gardening, earthly knowledge. Acedia kind of not caring, people without caring, laziness of the heart. They cannot grasp genuine history. Look at what the lazy do to nature. Do not put your faith in utopia on earth. Charged with the now time, staying in the now. Put your faith in the Redeemer. They grasp the shallow history of historicism and put to waste nature for pleasure. Four moons illuminate the earthly night. Ice recedes from the poles, seawater no longer tastes salty, 
Beasts are bred to do humans' bidding. We need history, but not the way of a spoiled loafer in the garden of knowledge needs it. So said Nietzsche. Do not put your faith in Nietzsche. Put your faith in the Redeemer. Some calendar holidays celebrate the victor in triumphant processes and not the cultural treasures stolen from the conquered. Calendars are like time-lapse photos. The same day keeps recurring in the guise of holidays, monuments to historical consciousness, like the July Revolution you know, people fired their bullets at the clocks in the towers to stop time in Paris, to stop the day. Do not put your faith in calendars. They cannot bring time to a standstill. Put your faith in the Redeemer. Humans on a 24-hour world clock have only lived two seconds two seconds till midnight. Do not put your faith in world clocks, in biology. Put your faith in the Redeemer. Linear time is like the rosary, a sequence of beads arranged in five decades. Do not put your faith in Catholic time devices, put your faith in the Redeemer. Jews don't use soothsayers. You know the Jews are forbidden to do soothsaying. I am propelled by a violent storm. My wings are spread. I go into the future. Put your faith in the Redeemer. I follow the Torah, 613 commandments. Jews do not investigate the future. Any second, Messiah could step through the straight gate. Any Second of time, be prepared. Messiah might enter. Put your faith in the Redeemer. The apocalypse is already here. The messianic cessation of happening. The era of history coming to an end. Time canceled. Each of the 13 points in the 13 images we have just seen are different ways to look at time. The rosary sequence is linear time. The calendar picks out historic holidays, something to celebrate. The now time, the 24 hour world clock has only the two seconds to midnight of Homo sapiens existence on earth. The 24 hour world clock Time eternal, time come to a stop, the Redeemer arrives. But when is your time up on earth? I could tell you, but then your time on earth would be over. If you liked our video, please go ahead and give us a like, give us a subscribe. We would very much appreciate that. And Look at the Tribal Wisdom Book of Grace Anne Rosile and Don Papillon's video and Gregory Cahiti and David Boji and more videos by Jay Francis on Tribal Wisdom because that's where we're going. You've seen different kinds of enthinkment today, different ways of thinking with different kinds of time. And explore the theaters of capitalism come to enthinkment. Our book has just arrived by 
Leslie Silco, and we are ready to drive into sacred waters in our next session. Thank you for showing up, and we bid you goodbye, good night. And I'm stopping time right now.